Humans have been bound to the earth since time immemorial. We were simply unable to escape its gravity. But mankind found a way not only to take flight, but to leave the earth completely and enter space. Man set himself the goal of flying to the moon very quickly. It was a very daring thought, a vision. But huge advancements were made within the space of just a few years. An army of people, including the brightest minds of their time, worked on it. People named the project of flying to the moon after a Greek Roman god, Apollo. A rocket was to take them to the moon. It was gigantic. Its engines were as powerful as an atom bomb. This rocket was capable of carrying three men in their spaceship. It was strong enough to overcome the Earth's gravity and fly far out into space. The three men were sitting in a small capsule at the tip of the rocket. On behalf of all of humanity, their job was to explore the moon. T-minus 15 seconds, guidance is internal. 12, 11, 10, 9, ignition sequence start. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0, all engine running. Three stages of rockets were necessary to escape the Earth's gravity before the empty black void of space could be reached. Once there, up and down disappear, but the Earth's beautiful fragile shell comes into view. The journey to the moon took three days. The small spaceship was like a walnut shell, drifting through space. The interior was cramped, and it was uncertain whether the three men would ever reach their destination. As the spaceship approached the moon, 
it was caught in its gravitational field, circling around it again and again. The astronauts got ready for the next step, the descent down to the lunar surface. Two of them were to make the descent, while the third remained in the spaceship. The spacecraft with which they were to land was a fragile module known as the Eagle. It separated from the main spacecraft and hurtled towards the surface of the moon. Millions of people at the time saw the pictures transmitted from the moon to the earth and shared in the excitement. Everyone was aware that it was a very special moment in the history of mankind. It was the first time humans ever set foot on another celestial body. The two astronauts made their dream a reality and achieved the impossible. In this moment, mankind was united. While the first two astronauts explored a new world, the third continued to orbit the moon in the spaceship. In those hours, he was the loneliest person in the universe. Seeing the blue home planet again must have been a special moment every single time. But man did not travel to the moon just to set foot on it. After all, humans are beings of curiosity, who always want to know what's hiding over the horizon. We wanted to find out how the moon came into being. The first humans on the moon were followed by several others. The astronauts carried out experiments that greatly expanded our knowledge, brought special vehicles with them, and traveled long distances on the moon. They didn't just stay a few hours, but several days. This strange place fascinated the astronauts, and it was difficult for them to say goodbye to it. They knew they would never return. We leave as we came, and God willing, as we shall return. With peace and hope for all mankind. Thank <laughs> you.
Unlike the Earth, the moon does not have a protective atmosphere surrounding it. Nothing ever changes there, as there is no wind or rain. Everything there lasts for eternity. Racing through space, they approached the Earth, becoming more aware than ever of the unique planet they lived on. They lacked the words to describe this poignant beauty. These images made the whole of humanity aware of how vulnerable our precious blue sphere really is. It was a miracle that such technical achievements were made in such a short period of time. This was only possible thanks to lots of people having a strong belief that they could achieve something which was completely insane. And they were right. The journey to the moon was the fulfillment of an ancient human dream. It taught us to see the Earth and ourselves from a completely new perspective. Just 24 people have seen the Earth from this perspective until today. This view changes everything. The astronauts on the Apollo missions have opened the door. Our journey through space has only just begun.